Hi everyone, Hi. welcome back to the channel. Today we are back here with Betty. It has been really so long without her. We are so excited. She's back on the show. We are really, really, really excited that she's really back here. She has been out for so long. She has to explain to you guys where she has been all this long. <laughs> I've been on the channel alone, struggling. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I'm so happy she's back. Betty, what do you have to say? Well, uh, I'm happy I'm also back. I'm so happy I'm back. I'm taking really long. Yeah, I'm going for Xmas. Yeah. New Year. <laughs> and a village setting. And you know, village setting. There's no internet. There's no watch. <laughs> so without internet, you don't have to come back. You don't have to be online. You don't have to. But I'm glad I'm back. I'm finally okay. glad I'm back. Yeah. I'm really so happy that we're really back. Yeah. So for today's video, we are really excited to bring for you a brand new video. And then snack, as you've already read the title, we are going to share some of the snacks that Ugandans really enjoy in our country. We have a variety of them that we are going to share with you guys. Hope you really enjoy this video. So let's get started. Let's begin with the first snack. Tell them what a snack is. What exactly is a snack? Okay, so how would you define a snack? Well, for me, a snack is a small portion of food yeah, eaten uh, before the real meal. When I talk about the real meal, I mean lunch, supper. Okay. <laughs> yeah, so in between. In between. In between, yeah. yeah. That, that's what I call a snack. Okay. Let's first start with our favorites. We also have snacks that we enjoy. <laughs> what is your favorite snack that you really enjoy in Uganda? Well, for me, it's the roasted maize. Yeah, okay, you love I maize. Them. Yeah, I love it so much. It's, okay. It tastes so nice. Yeah. Okay, how about the boiled one? Because I know maize can be roasted and also boiled. Oh, well, yeah. Well, yeah, we have, you know, we have the boiled one and we have the roasted one. So, your prefer. favorite? You My favorite is the, is the roasted one. The roasted one. Yeah. Okay, that is nice. Favorite snack, I must say. Mm -hmm. I love Simsim. Oh, Simsim. The, the ones, simsim balls ones that have a bit of sugar. <laughs> a bit of sugar. I know how they make them. Sugar and of course sugar. They first hit the sugar. Yes, they hit the sugar. Then it cools and a little bit. Uh -huh. It's not really very cool. Uh -huh. Then they put in the simsim. Then they roll. Uh -huh. So that snack is really so nice. It's very delicious. Oh, I also love it so much. I eat it once in a while. Every time I I'm, I'm moving and I what do you see get a to shop, do? I show. <laughs> Where they are the sold, shop. I'll definitely yeah, buy. Yeah. So them. let's get okay. to the usual snacks that we have in the country most of them i think we can start with what what else do you think um we have also gonja we uh our okay we call it oh, gonja yeah. gonja that, yeah. that does a plantain it's normally enjoyed by travelers yeah um, like people who are traveling they have stopovers and they want something to buy it gonja. outside yeah. the street food i think we shall even make our street foods in Uganda. Mm -hmm. It's one of the street foods that people enjoy and it's also a snack as well. So gonja, you can really go for it. It's mm -hmm. plantain, you mm -hmm. can even boil it. Some people boil it, yeah. some people just roast it, but it's really delicious. Yes. It's then really it nice. also has the deep fried one. So yeah, you that's... can eat it deep sure. fried, you can roast sure, it. Sure. Yeah. So that's gonja. gonja. Yeah. Then we have mm -hmm. mandazi. Mm -hmm. Mandazi, this, uh, what should I say? How should I describe? I think we shall just show you the picture and fry them then of course the mandazi comes up mm. they're really delicious for breakfast mm. in between the meals you can really eat any time mm. i still remember the mandazis we used to take like yeah, the small back at school, back at school mm. the, the donuts the small donuts at school when you're really hungry before lunch time mm -hmm. you could really run for those things mm. in your dormitories people who are who can connect with me who are in uganda <laughs> and you're in secondary school yeah. maybe in boarding school you can really connect with me you could mm. really eat that in between the meals, meals yeah. yeah. Then another thing that we have is the samosa. Samosa, samosa yes. Yeah. You like, now, now in Uganda, we call it sombus. What <laughs> 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 we call them sombusa? Okay, well, the samosas are really nice. Snacks. Yeah, they're Enjoy. really nice. These are, I think, um, we have vegetables, we, we have, have meat samosas, samosas. we, we have, have chicken samosas, chicken samosas <laughs> rice samosas, and cow peas. Cow peas, fresh and red. The meat one, the meat samosas are really nice, they're very delicious. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, then we also have ginats, mm -hmm. those are snacks that we enjoy. Mm -hmm. Ginats can be roasted, can be deep fried because most of the time, most people prefer them deep fried, mm -hmm. roasted. Mm -hmm. They're even packed in, in supermarkets, yes. you can get them in small packs. Mm -hmm. And people really enjoy granites really mm -hmm. so much. Yes, then we also have 
We also have the hard cones. The hard cones. So yes. tell us more about these hard cones. The hard cones are called the berenge. <laughs> in, in, in Uganda, I don't know. In, that's how I know them as in the local language. Most yeah. people in Uganda call them berenge. Yeah. Those are snacks that we, they are hard cones. Mm -hmm. We used the out maize, of maize, maize. Yeah, yes, possible. hard maize, dried maize, let me say. Mm -hmm. The maize is dried, then it is boiled later on to make it a little bit softer so, before yeah. they fry it. Mm -hmm. I still remember this was a snack they used to pack for me at school. Wow. I would really enjoy. Really? And I would, my friends would really look up to whenever <laughs> I come to school. <laughs> then we have also pumpkin seeds. Pumpkin seeds. The normal pumpkins, the seeds, they dry them up, then they roast them. Most people really enjoy the supermarkets. You can get them everywhere. You can do it at home, you can roast it at home, and you can be able to enjoy. And the pumpkin seeds are nutritious. They're very nutritious. Yeah, yeah, sure. nutritious yeah. I love them so much. I've mm. taken up, I've eaten them. Mm. Then we have the insanity. Insanity, yeah. yeah. Insanity, most enjoyed by the people in the central region. Mm. Those are the Baganda. What's the English word for insanity? Grasshoppers. Grasshoppers. <laughs> the grasshoppers, they are really enjoyed by most of the people around here. Yeah, but I think it's a specific type of grasshoppers. Yeah. Yeah. They're not. Okay. Yeah, yeah because they're very it's a specific types of... type of grasshoppers. So, and these they are, are grasshoppers. seasonal. They are seasonal. Yeah. But they're really so nutritious and very delicious. Mm -hmm. The first time I tested in Senene, uh -huh. do you know what the first part I, I started with? Uh -huh. I started with the head. <laughs> Can really try it out it's very nutritious you can really try this snack right yeah out. then we have the white ants the white ants sure. are also seasonal they yeah come, i think twice in a they come once in a year i don't know about that twice season. or once in a year but white so ants if you are don't also... enjoy it within that season you will never enjoy it again yeah and they, yeah. they some of some people even enjoy white ants when they are raw mm -hmm. i've i've seen some people eat them raw mm. most most especially in the central region people mm. eat them raw Raw. Oh yeah, they are tasty. They they're are just tasty. really. Yeah, they're I've raw. never really tasted them when they are really raw. But some people really fry them mm. when they fry and put in some little salt. Some they are salt, very yeah. nutritious and very nice. Back in Eastern Uganda, most people really eat it with even with 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 atapa, with, yeah, with, with millet, yeah, millet with, bread. Uh -huh. They enjoy yeah. it as a meal. Someone really takes it as a meal, but it's also snack because. Maybe because I think of poverty, maybe because of... No, it's not of... poverty. That's not... what is there to be eating. <laughs> okay, that's what's there. But of course, people really enjoy this, this, this white hands a lot. Then what else do we really have? We don't have to forget about the cassava, roasted cassava. It's oh, also yeah. snack. Mm -hmm. And it's wonderful. This roasted cassava can be enjoyed with very many things. You can even eat it with roasted meat. It tastes nice. Really? Yeah, or with tea. With it tea, I think, nice, yeah, with I think tea. For, 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 for roasted cassava, it's really with, it's really nice with tea. Mm. Those are some of the things that we came up with. If in case we missed out some of your favorite snacks that you've had in Uganda, that you've eaten in Uganda, then you can really leave us with a comment down below. We should have some snacks that we you have in your country that you want to share with us. Please just comment down below because we shall be really excited to read all your comments. Well, and we also would love to know what snacks you people enjoy in different parts of the world. That right? is because true. we've just shared with you what we enjoy. We enjoy in mostly what in our country and the most common snacks. Mm -hmm. Of course, there are also other snacks that we've not really mentioned mm -hmm. that are enjoyed here, but mm -hmm. those are at least the major those ones. Are the main, and those are the ones you shouldn't miss out when you, when you come, come to, to the Uganda. country. When you come to country to <laughs> Uganda, yeah, sure. Yeah, well, we are really so excited. I'm really so excited. Betty is really back with me. I'm so happy. <laughs> yes, she's really back to the channel and we are going to give you more interesting videos, a lot of them. So we are here. We are back to upload for you more videos, more interesting videos. Mm -hmm. So for this particular video, in case you really like what we really gave you, we shared with you, just give this video a thumbs up and also leave your comment share with your friends so that we can be able to have a lively community with you guys yeah and don't forget to give us feedback let us know put down your comments and let's engage let's engage i know i know yeah well yeah. thank you so much for watching let's see you in our next video bye bye